This year alone, 25,000 Canadian women will be diagnosed with breast cancer. But thanks to annual screenings and early detection, most of these women will survive and thrive after treatment, which is why local breast cancer survivors are now fundraising to replace the aging technology that saved their lives. Um, I was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2009 and I've been through the whole gambit, uh, chemo, radiation, uh, double mastectomy. Katrina Campbell is not a breast cancer survivor. We don't call ourselves survivors, we call ourselves thrivers. Go Island Breast Strokers! A huge reason she's thriving is the camaraderie of the Island Breast Strokers. We really are all a whole lot healthier and more connected than we were prior to our diagnosis. This island breaststroker beat breast cancer in 2002 and earlier this year. I've got involved in so many different things I never thought I'd be involved in through this team and this wonderful women. And that's what the team's all about. Women of all ages and fitness levels proving that exercise and friendship play a vital role in thriving after breast cancer. Part of our mandate is to support other breast cancer survivors out in the community and help them understand that they, they too can thrive and live a healthy lifestyle. And also to raise money to fight the disease. Nobody wants to get breast cancer. If you're going to get it, we'd like to catch it really early. And that means replacing this 10-year-old machine with the latest technology. The Victoria Hospitals Foundation is now fundraising for a $420,000 mammography and stereotactic biopsy machine. No one here has a laptop that's 10 years old or a cell phone that's 10 years old. Technology is constantly changing and there is a need to upgrade this machine. We finished raising about $35,000 for the BC Cancer Foundation. This was donated from the Island Breast Strokers. This two-time breast cancer thriver organized a silent auction at her workplace. She hopes to raise $15,000. I will always do what I can. Without that machine, I just wouldn't be here. I have no doubt in my mind. The medical community is grateful that these women are giving back. If we didn't have the kind of fundraisers that we have, we'd never be able to keep up with the new machines. You can support the Island Breaststrokers fundraising campaign at the links tab on our website. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.